Okay, what it do, what what it do, what it do, what it do. Basically, I want to talk about um, the impact your family, your parents, you know, whether it be both parents or single parent home, uh, the impact your parents have on your life, you know, your future. Um, um, then basically, this kind of a broad topic because it, it can go everywhere, but I, it's kind of like, dude, I was wondering if there's people that feel like, um, a lot of things in your life could have been prevented if your parents would have took, parents or parent would have took a different step or aspect or did something differently. Like, you know, there's people like myself that hold things in from the past for a very, very, very long time that show a lot of resentment towards their parents. Um, so I was just wondering, like, do you feel as though some things that that's going on in your life right now as you, you being older, do you feel it could have been prevented, some of your issues you have, could it have been prevented from uh, things that you feel was your parents' fault? I guess if I can explain that right. Like, you know how you just be older and then you go to them hard times where you're just thinking about everything, like a mild depression, whatever you want to call it, and you're just kind of like, man, if I would have had a dad, you know what I'm saying? I'll be all right. If my mom was there, I'll be cool. You know what I'm saying? You just start finding things. That could, I don't call that excuse because you'd be surprised how many children, um, teenagers, everything. Um, life is fucked up. I mean, my mom is here. But, you know, life is fucked up because their parents, you know, were either too into drugs, you know what I'm saying, didn't care about them or was too into their boyfriends or their girlfriends, you know, et cetera. So I was just, that's just one topic I always thought about, like, because uh, sometimes I feel like that, you know. So, uh, it was, it's just, I don't know, it's a good topic, I think, but you feel as though your parents, your, your future could have been different or your present time of being an older, a young adult could have been, you could have had less issues if, your parents would have did you right, basically. You know what I'm saying? Because you, you got to admit here, you know what I'm saying? There's parents that do what they got to do. They're taking care of their children. But then there's a lot of them that they think taking care of a child financially is is the key to raising a good child. You know what I'm saying? What about emotionally being there for your child, physically being there for your child? There's a lot of parents that don't tell their children they love them and so on and so forth. So I was just... Hello? Um, curious about it and as you see there's my mother in the background walking around whatever donk a donk all in my camera time but yeah so I don't know I always say so and yeah cause I've been thinking about a lot of serious things you know I've been kind of get tuned in with you motherfuckers um, cause I know I'm goofy and silly at all times but I do think about serious shit like that like like I do that from time to time, like, what the fuck, you know what I'm saying, when you down and out and you need help, you know what I'm saying, because I do live alone, I visit my mom's house frequently, but at the end of the day, those bills have my name on them, and I'm obligated to pay them, not my mother, you know what I'm saying, she's done all she could, all she's could for these 22 years that I've been alive, but as far as that, I've had that side of the bitch, hold on. Yeah, I have that side of the fence. My mother, you know what I'm saying? I was raised in a single parent home. I had other, you know, figures such as aunties and grandmother and grandpa and all that. But it's still not the same when you don't have, you know what I'm saying? You feel as though, damn, what would my life been different if I would have had two parents in my life? And that's how sometimes I feel when I'm not in a happy mood. I'd be like, damn, you know what I'm saying? Maybe if my dad was around maybe things would be different, you know what I'm saying, I can have two shoulders to lean on, you know what I'm saying, because I got two shoulders of my own, but you need two shoulders from your parents, like, I'm only leaning on my mom, and I can only lean on her for so much, you know what I'm saying, so that's how I developed to become independent, so in a way, it helps you, and it hurts you, it hurts you in a lot of ways, and it helps you in a lot of ways, so it's an equal, equal situation, but at the end of the day, everybody want love, you know what I'm saying, and I'm independent and, you know what I'm saying, old soul, you know what I'm saying, can handle my own, but I got feelings, you know what I'm saying, 
I'm a human being. I got things. So I really do. This is the idea of my own. I want some. I I really want to sign. I ain't looked it up on a computer. Watch them on now. I I want some counseling, like some therapy. You know what I'm saying? I you know what I'm saying. Get it all out, cause I I keep coming to the same rock. You know what I'm saying? I kind of pat trip over it and ignore it, kick it out the way and keep going. But I'm gonna have to face this rock. You know what I'm saying? That rock. You already know that rock really is my father. Like he cool people, but he gets on my nerves, and I got a lot of. Resentment. I got a lot of shit on my chest that where, you know what I'm saying, anything triggered when I'm with him, he can say something that I think is smart and I just be ready to tell him and say, clock his teeth. I'm ready to just run everything down from uh, 9187 till 91 2000 motherfucking 9. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to conclude this because I'm getting too deep in here. But I would greatly appreciate feedback from y'all motherfuckers. Please and thank you. Because, I mean, it is what it is. But I'm about to get out this piece. This is the last video for tonight. Um, I've got to get up early and get these eyes checked. Try to give me some new frames, you dig? But, um, I love all y'all. I hope y'all have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful fucking Saturday weekend, whatever. Party up for me. Hit a Buddha for me. Do something. You know what I'm saying? Um, much love, though. I'm out.